We're back in the CI Kitchen now. Sure, we're getting ready to enjoy a lighter beef and broccoli for dinner tonight in the CI Kitchen. Leia Kedem, nutrition and wellness educator for the U of I Extension, made this Chinese-inspired dish, though, with mm -hmm. a twist on the noodles. Tell us about yeah. it. Yeah, so, you know, to lighten up the dish a little bit, add some more vegetables. I'm all about that. We actually made zoodles or zucchini noodles with my cool spiralizer gadget, which I love. You need one of these because you like yeah. to do low carb with being diabetic. So uh -huh. do you have, do you like zoodles? I like saying it? zoodles. <laughs> so that's zoodles. Yeah. Well, so I you mixed broccoli your broccoli boodles. Boodles. That's fun to say too. Yeah, that's fun, but you'll but you yeah. mixed your zoodles with your regular noodles. Is I that did. normal? Well, <laughs> what's what's normal? What's normal, what's normal you know, when you've eaten strawberry pie today yeah, with your face? I know. Yeah, yeah, I know. That's true. It's all Look, relative. You can you can take out the actual stir fry noodles and replace with zoodles if you want to make it lower carb, lower calorie. But you know, to compromise, do a little bit of regular noodles. And again, some people are a little picky. I, I know that I would probably get in trouble um, from some people here if I didn't bring the real noodles. <laughs> you know, it's like every Never. no. Sometimes I hear. Oh, Where's my bacon? You didn't bring me the bacon this time. Man, so, well, sorry. Ign ignore them. Okay, That's ignore right. them. Stick with yeah. us. Here. That's right. So okay, give this so. a shot. Could we do anything different? Could we do chicken instead of beef? Of course you can. Yeah, you okay. can definitely try different proteins. Um, I did use a sirloin, which is a leaner cut of beef, so you can do like chicken breast or. Mm. How's or, your zoot? <laughs> it's really good. Yeah, get the. the I can't even. The, <laughs> the noodle. It's really good. It's good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So. Okay, so what else? What's where is the biggest nutrition? Because since you're a dietitian, this, yeah. that's your thing. Of course. And trying to get you know both the taste and the nutrition. So where am I? Obviously the zucchini. Yeah, we stuff. added nutrition there by using the zucchini to make noodles. But also I did add broccoli as well. Beef and broccoli they go together really well. Yeah, they do. Um, you know, there's onions and garlic. Great. Mm -hmm. People don't really think about them as vegetables, but they are. Um, and we've also got spices in there. We've got some ginger, which has antioxidants. Mm. And also, I mean, this is a lot of food, all mm -hmm. right, for relatively few calories. The, the recipe serves four people. One, two, three. I mean, you probably and could have gotten more. And there's only three zoodles, three, three zucchinis worth of noodles. I used two. Oh, it was I only, only two, two noodles? Yeah. That's a so lot. So it's a lot of food. It's very satisfying. Have to for chewing. Yeah. You'd cook that meat perfectly. I would never guess these are zoodles and not just noodles. <laughs> Well, who knew? Who knew? Now we do. <laughs> hey, Leia's recipe is online. Thanks so much for being here. We appreciate it. See you tomorrow at 4.